Hey there, I'm Christopher Sabat, voiceover guy and longtime FreshBooks user. FreshBooks has asked me to show you how to create and send your first invoice. By the way, FreshBooks has some pretty awesome tools for tracking your time and monthly expenses here and here. Definitely check those areas out after we're done, but for now we're just going to click on Create an Invoice. Let's say I just finished recording a huge series of ground-pounding monster truck commercials. I, I live in Texas, so yeah, this happens. And now I need to invoice for my work. The first thing FreshBooks needs to start the invoice is a client. Since there's only one sample client in this list, I'm going to make a real one by clicking on New Client. Let's call them Mud Pit Productions, Inc. Here I'm going to enter in all of my client's info. Feel free to be as detailed as you like, but all FreshBooks needs to move forward is an organization name and an email address. Now click Save Client. OK, now that I have a client, I'll show you how to set up a basic invoice. On the right, you'll see that I can set up my own invoice number, date, PO number, and discount. And once I've set up online payments for my invoice, it's easy for my clients to pay with PayPal or a credit card. For now, I'll leave it all as is. My next step is to add an item to my invoice. This can be a simple name, product code, or, in my case, a category, voiceover. Under Description, I'll put 30-second Monster Truck Ad Series. And then I'll add a quantity here. From here, go ahead and click Save Item. This will place the item in your invoice. If you ever need to change an item, you can always come back and do that. Let's add a few more items. If I need to add tax to any one of my line items, I can do that by clicking the little gear and entering in a name and percentage there. This tax item will be saved for the next time I need it. Almost done. These boxes down here for terms and notes are optional. I usually put, thank you for your business, please pay your invoice within 30 days. You know, FreshBooks did some research on this, and it's scientifically proven that you get paid 5% faster if you're polite in your invoices. All right, this invoice looks ready to roll. I've got three options down here. The Save as Draft button does just that. It saves it as a draft copy that you can preview and edit, and then send along whenever you're ready. But I'm going to click Send by Email. This shows me a quick preview of the email my client will see. You can add a custom message here if you want. Looks good to send, and away it goes. What happens next is my client receives an email that looks a little something like this. And here's a little something I love. Ever had a client say, I uh, never got your invoice? Well, FreshBooks actually tracks the precise moment an invoice has been viewed, along with the entire history of an invoice beneath it. Anyway, the client clicks this link to view the invoice, uses a credit card or PayPal to send payment, my records are updated automatically, and I receive the funds right about now. So, those are the basics of sending an invoice with FreshBooks. Pretty easy, right? Now that you know the basics, take a minute and try sending yourself a test invoice now. It's the best way to get started. Until next time, on behalf of FreshBooks, I'm Christopher Sabat. Thanks for watching.